I'm joined by Lou Studdart from Toys for Bob. Oh, Lou, I love Lou. Yeah, so the way that the, the flashback tape levels work is that they are kind of a peak back in time to the 90s when Neocortex was actually testing on Crash and Coco before Wait, the events of Crash Bandicoot 1. And Whoa. there are these devious puzzle rooms that we've made. Whoa. Uh, and they're really hard and they're really awesome. And yes. Super creative and we can't wait to uh, get people's hands on them. Yeah, difficult no, I, levels I, I got yes to demo this a few weeks ago and that was a challenge so i can't imagine um how nefarious these are um how are they going to be sort of integrated into the game are they are they optional like offshoot stuff or how do you how do you get to them sure so players actually have to collect the flashback tapes in the levels themselves oh cool uh, they're an object that they can pick up and to actually pick them up they have to reach them in the level without dying it's uh, kind of oh, a nice. to the death routes cool. from the original trilogy. So players have okay. to reach these objects in the level, pick them up, and then once they get them, they'll get access to oh, these cool. unique levels. So beyond the pure challenge, uh, what other fun? So how, how are these fun for players to kind of experience? And what do they get to do in them? Sure. So one of the things that we did was we actually used these as, like I said, puzzle rooms, really kind of fun, nefarious so cool. ways for Crash that's to really so, so cool. that pure platforming kind of uh, aspect of gameplay. That oh, man, I love this already. Narratively for us, it was really cool to layer in kind of a unique oh, perspective. <laughs> it looks super franchise. tough. I love this it. The moment when Cortex is really excited about the prospect of Crash being on his team because Crash was originally created by Cortex. And oh, so, so this cool. is a weird point in time that's never really been explored in the game's program. Oh, that's so, awesome. so cool. All right, well, Crash 4, it's about time. Looks phenomenal, Lou. Uh, we cannot wait to check it out uh, in October. Thanks for joining us. Oh, that's so awesome. Yeah, thanks for having me.